Hey, Steve here. Um, I want to show you guys a, my quick way of coloring my artwork really quick. Um, the first thing I do is, uh, actually, it's already separated. So, actually, it's, I, have to, I usually ungroup everything after I use the method in one of my previous tutorials on how I go about inking and then merge it all together. But um, I make a copy of the original line work. I select it all, then actually go to light paint. I use light paint because it's an easier way for me to drop all the colors in really quick. And if I want to change them later, it's pretty simple. So, I mean, let me change the color to something different. I mean, I, I'm not sure if it's the most effective way to do it, but as I said, it's pretty quick for me to color a lot of my stuff in. But I'm just I'm not gonna do the whole thing, but what I do is after it's all been light paint if you get your whole light paint done, you select the whole object again and go to expand. And then you get the direct select tool and click on this is why I, I try to limit the color so it's not that many, so I click on the color I want with the direct select tool, then go to select same. Fill color. Then create a new layer and drag and drop those colors in there. So pretty much all the same colors are now in one layer. So I can easily manipulate or change the colors or do anything I want with the Pathfinder tool or whatever for each individual color or actually each object itself. But I mean I hope this gives you a slight grasp on how to easily separate colors and color really quickly. And then you, any other videos I have about using the pencil tool and so forth, you can implement them in here as well. So appreciate you guys watching the videos and hope this helps in some way.